See to it that you are important. The world is divided into VIPs, very important persons, and UUPs, utterly unimportant persons. The small child of a second cousin of the Queen is a VIP. The second cousin of a licensed victualler from Nuneaton or the second cousin of a dishwasher from Hlangochlan is a UUP. Some selfish people fail to realise this just because they are of some importance to themselves. It is true that if you kick a UUP it will hurt him just as much as a similar kick would hurt a VIP. The only difference being that the unimportant person is likely to be kicked more often and much harder. Unimportant tears will be just as bitter as important tears, but they are shed more frequently. There are also important and unimportant nations. Two million Indians starving to death are not terribly exciting because they are the extreme cases of UUPs. Besides, they are used to starving to death. Admittedly, starving to death needs some getting used to, but they do have tremendous practice. After a disaster in which two people have been killed, we are supposed to rejoice that the death toll was not 20 or 200, whereas at reports that the American forces have killed a hundred Viet Cong guerrillas, we are supposed to be upset because it was not 200 or 500. We often received satisfactory reports about the recession of an epidemic, saying that only three people died on the day before. But we rarely hear any dead man remark, how delightful, only one man has died today, myself. Of course, three deaths are better than 30, 30 are better than 300, and 300 are a trifle compared to 3,000, and three deaths may be a mere 0.0023% of the total population of a community. But for each of the three who died, the death rate is 100%. He will be 100% dead. All people, VIPs and UUPs alike, have only one life each. 1. Perhaps VIPs should have 1.35 and UUPs only 0.78. But they all have just one.